Today we will learn how to upload an order guide to MenuMax. To begin this process, we need to enter the products section. You can do this by clicking on the products button in the top navigation, or from the home screen on MenuMax, we can click on the products order guide icon. I'm going to go ahead and click on the icon. Now, to add our order guide to the system, we can click on this Add New Order Guide button here in the top right corner, or we can click the Add Order Guide icon. Both of these places will launch the import wizard. Step one of the wizard is to give our order guide a name. So I'm going to go ahead and start typing my vendor's name, and as I type, MenuMax will populate the vendor contact information of those that are already in the system. If you see your vendor's contact information, just click and MenuMax will automatically populate these fields. If you do not see your vendor's contact information, you can click here to add that information manually. Just be sure when you're done you click Save. Now, since I have an order guide all set to upload, I'm going to click in this Yes box under Do you have an order guide ready to upload? And I will browse my computer to find the file. Now, I will warn you that your order guide needs to be in an Excel or a .csv, comma separated value file. I'll click continue. Now, in step two of the import wizard, we need to match the menu max fields to the fields in my order guide. So if we click here, we can preview my order guide in MenuMax. And we will see that the headers in my order guide are SKU, name of item, brand, unit, size, and price. I'm going to click preview again to get rid of that. So what I need to do is I need to match the MenuMax fields to the correct fields from my order guide. In this case, item number is equal to SKU, product name is equal to name of item, brand is equal to brand, pack to unit, size is equal to size, and price to price. Now, let's say that there was the wrong information in this box that we had unassigned. Using the drop down pad, we can select what information we want to match to. I'll change it back to SKU since that was correct. So step two is just matching the menu max fields to the correct field headers in your order guide. Since we're done with this, we'll click next. And now menu max will give me an import summary for my order guide. Here we can see that I have two errors, three warnings, and 876 items that have been accepted. If I hover here over the error, MenuMax will tell me the problem. Here it's telling me I have duplicate primary key. So if I compare these items, I'll see that everything is the same. Item number, name, brand, pack, size, and price. So MenuMax just needs me to select which one I want to import. So I'll click one. I'll come down here and I'll click this revalidate to add that information to the system. And MenuMax will automatically make that change for me. Now my errors are gone, but I still have three warnings. So if I hover over the warnings, I will see that the product has no price. And if I come over here, I can see that's the problem for all three items. So I'm going to go ahead and give them all a price. And I can manually add this information. And again, I'll click Revalidate. And MenuMax again will automatically add that item to the system for me with those changes. Here I can see that I have zero errors, zero warnings, and 880 items that have been accepted. Now I'll click Done. And here on the product list page, I will see the order guide that I just added to MenuMax. Now we can click go back. 
and here on the products order guide screen I will see the order guide that I just uploaded to the system. And that is how you add an order guide to MenuMap.